on the 1st of February 2003, Columbia began its descent back to Earth. As the shuttle raced over the Pacific towards the US, the crew put on their suits, preparing themselves for a routine landing. It was now 8.40 a.m. and these are pictures of their last moments alive. Lowell, do you need help? I think I'm almost. Okay. After you get yours, then I'll get mine. Good hair it quick, but... Actually... Okay, I'm not sure I know I'm done. Okay. Can I give this to you? I'm, I, already, I don't have that bag anymore. Okay. Then don't worry. Uh, I can, uh, I can grey tape it up here if you want. That's a good idea. Are you ready for the camera, Laura? You said. Oh, uh, one minute. Okay. No rush. Got yep. plenty of time. You see, I got another thing to populate your. All right. I got it. Really. Okay. Let's just uh, let's go ahead and make 
sure you check your suit pressure integrity too. All right. FYI, I've just lost four separate temperature transducers on the left side of the vehicle, uh, hydraulic return temperatures. Four high return temps? To the left outboard and left inboard elevon. In Columbia, Houston, we see your tire pressure Compton. messages and we did not copy your last. Is it instrumentation, Max? Uh, flight Max, those are also off. Roger, off the Columbia, Houston, com check. Houston UHF com check. GC flight. GC flight. Fly GC. Lock the doors. Copy. Thirty eight miles above ground, the space shuttle had exploded. All seven on board were killed. 